so if you have your Bibles, we're going to be working from uh, John. So if you have your Bibles, we're going to be working from John chapter ten. John today. chapter ten. We're just going to look at the first ten verses. John chapter ten. Today. We're just going to uh, look so at the first ten this verses. This is the section today. of scripture where uh, Jesus so describes this himself is the as the door. section of scripture where Jesus gate. describes himself as the door. Exploring this morning, or the gate. And that's what we're exploring this morning. John chapter ten, starting at verse one. I tell you the truth. John chapter ten. Anyone who sneaks I tell you over the, the wall of a sheepfold, anyone who sneaks going over the wall the gate, of a sheepfold, must surely rather be than going thief through the gate and a robber, must surely be a thief. But the one who enters through the gate is the. But shepherd the one who enters the sheep. through the gate, the is gatekeeper the opens the gate the for him, and the sheep recognize. The gatekeeper his voice opens and the gate for him, him, and the sheep recognize. He calls his, his own sheep by him. name. He calls his own sheep by name. And leads them after out. he has gathered his own flock, he walks ahead of them. After and he has gathered his own flock, he walks ahead they of know them. His voice. And they follow him because they won't they follow know a stranger. His voice. They will run from him. They won't follow because a stranger. They, don't know his they will voice. run from him because they don't know his Those voice. who heard Jesus use this illustration didn't understand. Those who understand heard Jesus he use this illustration so he didn't explained it to them. what he meant. I so tell he you the truth. It to them. I am the gate. I tell you the truth. I All who came before me were thieves and robbers. All who came before but the me true were thieves sheep did not and listen robbers. to them. But the true sheep yes, did not am listen the gate. to them. Those yes, who come I in through me will be saved. Those who come in they through me will come and go freely saved. and find They will come good and go pastors. freely and find good The thief's pastors. purpose is to steal the thief's kill purpose and destroy. is to steal Kill my purpose and destroy is to give them a rich and satisfying my life. Is to give them a rich and satisfying life. What a passage! Um, what a passage! I have to confess, I found um, this passage to be a bit challenging to prepare to preach on. I found this passage to be a bit challenging to prepare to preach on because I thought, oh yeah. And then every time passage, I've read it, I've it'll gone, be easy. Oh, and, and then this. every time I've read it, and I've this, gone, and oh, this, and, and so this. much is, and this, um, and this is being and said so in much these illustrations is, um, that Jesus is gives. Being so said in a little bit of a confession that Jesus gives. I'm not so going to be able to do it justice in the time that we have I'm not going to be able to do it justice in the time that we have this morning. It would take multiple um, sermons for me to you know, really help It would take multiple sermons really for me to really what's going on here and what he's saying. Really grasp and yet what's Jesus going on here and what he's saying. Says it all in just and a yet few Jesus masterful says it all sentences. in just a it's, few. It's quite, I think, a, a profound sentences. passage. It's, so it's quite, um, I think, a, a profound. One commentator passage, explains um, that the parable. One commentator Jesus explains are, are called, that the parables um, Jesus Marshall, use here are, are called the style that um, they are, and, and, and they may have a main point. The style that they but are, and, parable and they that may have a main point. Back to, and, but they're a parable that you can say more and more, and that's how it's meant to be. We'll say more uh, so and more, and that's we won't how it's be experts be, uh, in this so passage. By we won't the end be of this experts morning. in this um, passage. By the a end, quote of this quote I've got here is this: this passage in John ten. A quote I've got here is this: this passage in John ten is a mysterious thought. saying. So that's what we're up for. Compressed thought. And as verse six points out, so that's what out, we're up for. Some people will read it. And as verse six and points understand out, understand lots. Some people will read some it. People and will read understand lots, and they'll miss most. Some people will read it. So, uh, and they'll miss. I pray most that of this it. morning we'll get what we need to so, uh, out of it. Each I pray one that this morning we'll get what we need to okay, out of it. I want to start by highlighting the main point. Okay, I want to um, start by which highlighting is reasonably the clear, main I think. point. What do you think? Um, which is reasonably the main clear. Point of I think. What do you think verses might be? The anyone main point of these ten verses. Want to try and name it? anyone? Want to try and name it? Yep. Yep. Yep, that's about yep. it. That's the main point. Jesus is the that's way. That's about it. He is the one. The main he is point. the Jesus only is the way. one that he can is offer the one. salvation. He is the only one, He's the only that, one that, that offers offer life salvation. in abundance. He's the only one that offers that's life in abundance. That's eternal life, but it's also and life in the here and now. That's eternal life, but it's abundance also today. life in the here and now. Now, life the reason that today. Jesus is wanting now, the to say reason this, that Jesus is to help us to recognize wanting to say that there this, have is been to help others, us to recognize and there, that there will be have been many others, others who will try and there and will claim be many that they others have the who will try and claim that they can lead us they have into the answers life. we need that they can lead us but they into are wrong. life essentially you know 
what, but they are what wrong, the world offers us, what you know, other teachers what, who have come what before him, and in this case, what Jesus other teachers who have come before him, and in this case, the, the Pharisees and religious leaders of his time. talking about the, the Pharisees what they are and religious are leaders of his time. Best half what they are selling you know, are at a best shadow half-truths. of what the kingdom you know, really a, a shadow is wanting to say, of what and the kingdom in some cases, really is wanting untruths. to say, and lies. in some and, cases, and that's. Untruths. What Jesus is Lives. talking about and, here. And so some of the teachers what Jesus that is have come about before him have actually so some been of the robbing people of life. That have come before him have actually been robbing people of life. So context here is important. I want to highlight so context what comes before here is important. Jesus telling this parable. I want to highlight what comes before been quite a build Jesus up telling to this parable. Jesus telling this story. There's been quite a build up to Jesus this telling this story. This parable comes... Just after Jesus this parable had comes the man just from after blindness Jesus by had spitting in the mud the man from and making a by, you know, spitting a in the mud if you like and, and making a it on the man's you know a poultice if you like and, and so rubbing this it man on the man's born eyes. blind um, and so you know, this man who was born to, blind, to be able to see, um, you know, now the Pharisees, to, to be able they get all see. hot and bothered by this. Now the Pharisees, they get all hot and bothered by this. Primarily because, because, Jesus, by has this work primarily because on the Jesus has done work. One of their rules is that you Sabbath. can't make you know, medicines. One of their rules is that you can't make medicines. You can't work. make a poultice on and the Jesus, Sabbath. And Jesus, that's. Work. I suspect quite intentionally and Jesus chose to heal I suspect him quite using that method on the Sabbath to heal him to make a point using that method on um, the Sabbath. So the Pharisees are all up in arms um, about it. They so the Pharisees are all up in arms parents, about it. They interrogate this, this, man, himself himself parents, times, this man himself a couple of times. They interrogate this man himself a couple of times. The guy who's been healed is like, this guy, is ridiculous. And the he guy starts been to argue with him. Like, this is ridiculous. And, um, and he starts and he, to argue with him. And he gets to the point where he says, and, um, if and this he, man, he gets Jesus, the point where he wasn't from God, he wouldn't have been able to heal Jesus wasn't from God, he wouldn't have been able to heal being the experts in all things God and the Pharisees being the experts in all things God and the Lord. Found How that do you reckon um, they uh, <laughs> response. Found that they um, <laughs> they got response. all you know prideful they, and scoffed at they him got and all, said you know you were born into sin. Him and said how dare you, were you try born and into us. sin? How dare you try? And so and they teach kick us. him out of the synagogue. And so they kick him out of this the is synagogue. Like. This is an amazing miracle like, has just happened before their an eyes. Amazing, right? A man, miracle has just you know, happened before their eyes. In blind, right? a man, for let's say thirty years. You know, we don't know his exact in age. Blind for all let's his say life. And everyone years. knew his exact age. Right? That's why they, they, they everyone knew they make this statement. You were born in sin. That's why they they make this statement. You were claiming you know sin. You were blind. You were cursed. They're claiming you know sin in your family. You were cursed. You were nothing. Because there was sin in your family. You know you're nothing. They can see the profound life. miracle. They knew who he was. They can see the but profound of, miracle. They knew who in he this was. moment being but excited of, and rejoicing in this moment going, being excited and rejoicing and going, what a wonderful thing God up. has done. They're all they're caught confused, up. right? They're confounded, they're confused, because, confused, you know, right? this blindness is because of because sin, right? You know, now, this blindness is because of sin, been right? Healed and now through an act that they would declare healed. Through an act that how they dare Jesus work sin. on the Sabbath? How dare Jesus? How dare make Jesus a work on the Sabbath? How dare that Jesus went against make all their rules, all their understanding that of what it means to be righteous? That went against all their rules, all their understanding of what it means to be righteous, to be a good it doesn't you know, make follower sense to of God. This, this can't it be. doesn't make sense to them. This, they miss can't be. And right before it. Jesus shares this parable, and right before Jesus he actually has shares this parable. We actually have an encounter in their confusion where he's Pharisees them blind. In their confusion where are the ones who are blind. He says, You are the ones who are blind. And so then we come to this parable and, and the point And so then we come to this parable, parable and, and the point of this parable who tries to is that not everyone or lead or who tries to teach or lead or is influence. doing so in agreement with God. Is not doing everything so that people try and say, with not God. Every piece not every of advice that people, that people try and give say, us not every piece of advice good. that people give us, not everyone is, is leading people to life. Not everyone and is Jesus leading people, people to, to life. To be awake and to Jesus this. wants Alert people to, this. to to be awake to this. Alert to now this. to really appreciate and understand this parable now to really about appreciate the gate and understand the sheep. this parable you probably have about to understand the gate a little bit of sheep. What 
you shepherding probably have looked to understand like a little bit of what East. shepherding. So they didn't have like farms in the, in the way that we have farms. So they, they didn't, didn't have farms, you know, in the way that we have farms. Of fencing, so they didn't have that kept you know, sheep kilometers of fencing, the boundaries that of the kept property, sheep kept them in the the, the farmers, boundaries you know, of the property, kept them and in everything, the, kept them the farmers, safe. you know, pasture um, and they everything, had kept them shepherds. safe. And so um, shepherds would hang around shepherds. with the flock of sheep. And so shepherds um, would hang and around, them around with the flock to different of sheep. places, and it wasn't um, and their land. And lead them around right? they, to different they places. They went out and into the wilderness. Land, they went right? all they, around wherever they went there out was into the wilderness. You know, they grass went all around and, and wherever there was sheep. They took you know, them good there. grass. That's and, how and farming worked. It was they different them to how we do it. That's how farming worked. It was different. To how but we as do you it can today. imagine, the shepherds probably needed to sleep. But as you can imagine, the shepherds uh, probably, probably needed, needed break, to sleep um, occasionally. From time to time, uh, they probably needed a break. And they had um, a couple of ways that they managed this. So, and they had they a couple had of ways pens, that they managed. And there were two so main. They had sheep pens, you know, versions and there were of two. This. And in this parable, you know, Jesus actually touches on both types. And in this types, parable, Jesus actually touches on both ways types, that these sheep both pens work. So the first one ways that these that sheep he refers pens work. So the first the one communal that he refers pen. to is so the communal normally sheep attached pen. to a village. So sometimes actually normally attached you know, using to the walls a village. Of sometimes some of the, actually the houses you know, using the walls in the village. Of some of the, there would be the a communal sheep and buildings in the village, and there would be a communal in that situation there would be a gatekeeper whose job it was. Situation, there would be a gatekeeper the wrong whose job it was coming to and interfering with stop the sheep. The wrong they kind of coming let and interfering all the shepherds with in the sheep. and they kind let of those who owned the sheep shepherds in come and deal with it. But they, those who owned the sheep, they, they were kind of like a, a security it, they, guard, really. They they were kind of like and, a, and a that security was their job. Guard, they opened really. the gate for the shepherds, and, that, and they that was knew. their job. They, they didn't opened the gate for the shepherds for those that shouldn't. They didn't open the gate for those that shouldn't be there. Now that didn't always stop. Now, people trying that didn't to sneak always in and steal stop. a lamb and, people and whatnot. Trying to that sneak kind of in and steal a lamb uh, and, and whatnot. Um, that kind of business was, uh, went has on. Been um, for has been part of the human condition for thousands and thousands of years. part of the human condition for thousands and thousands of years. And so... Using this first um, analogy, Jesus and so is effectively saying Using this here, first analogy, Jesus um, is effectively that saying This is what here, the Pharisees were um, like. That they were this is what the building Pharisees ladders were and like. climbing in over they the wall. They were building ladders and climbing in over the gate. Wall, rather through their than own traditions, their own the gate, structures. Through their own uh, traditions, they were bringing their own, their own agendas. And uh, they were bringing their own agendas. It was and stealing it was life. It was robbing theft. people it was of the life that stealing life. God it was wanted robbing them people to have. of the life that God um, wanted them to have. They um, some of their teachings were not teaching that God agreed some of their they didn't teachings have God's authority so Jesus God is contrasting didn't himself have God's with that authority saying, so Jesus is I am the one that, with that, that God saying, has approved of I am the one you can that, trust my that God has approved watch what of. I say you can trust I'm the my one teaching you has watch the words what I of say life. I am the one who has the words he contrasts of himself with the religious leaders he of the day contrasts himself with he is unlike the any teacher day. who has he come before them. He is unlike uh, bef- any teacher him. who has come before them, and especially uh, bef- unlike these him. Pharisees who scoff, and especially and unlike these Pharisees who scoff and kicks him and out of man the synagogue. Who has been he says, and kicks him that's out of not the my synagogue. religion. He says, "I am not. That's like not that. my religion. I am. I am the one true shepherd. I am the one true shepherd." That God that approves sense. of. Now, the second type of sheep pen sense. was a now, little bit different. The second different. type of sheep pen uh, it wasn't was so a much a communal different. sheep pen, although it would have been uh, used it wasn't by so much a communal sheep probably. pen, although it would have been used by multiple but it was shepherds, out, probably away from the village. But it was out, out in the wilderness, away from the village. So you can imagine these the shepherds. If they're all so trying you can to, imagine these you know, shepherds, just keep their sheep if they're all within, trying to, you know, you know, just keep their sort sheep of half within, a day or a day's you know, travel from sort of the half village, a day you know, or so a day's they can travel get back home from at night, the village, have a you shower, know, so they can get back and, home you know, at night, and their wife have a shower, and you know, they're kiss all competing their, their wife for resources, whatever, and you can't grow as many sheep that way, right? And you can't grow as many sheep that way. If they wanted to fatten their sheep, they had to go further. If they wanted to fatten their sheep, they had to travel. Further, away from sometimes home. Sometimes they would graze their sheep for and months away from And they would build home. over time, like they didn't and just do it in one go. They would build over time, like pens they didn't just do it in one go. But they would build pens out of rocks. They would make rock walls. And so at night, they would the bring wilderness. their sheep in into these. And so 
at um, night, they would bring their sheep in into these and um, look after them in enclosures. There. Now, in these cases, and look there after was them no in gate. there. Now, in these cases, there was no gate. There was no gate. There was just an opening. There was no gate that sheep could get through. Just an opening. That was it. That sheep could get and so through. so this is where you see that Jesus saying, "I am the gate." And so this is where you see Jesus because what saying, the role "I am of the, the gate. shepherds." Uh, because what the, what, the those, those, um, uh, pens, what the role of the shepherds did in those pens, the role of shepherds did in those in the gate. Pens, so they would they would wake up if the wolf gate. came. So they would, they would wake, wake up if, if someone tried came. to steal the they sheep. They would they were wake right up there. if someone tried to steal so the they sheep. They were right were there. The defenders and, and protectors so they of the sheep. The defenders and protectors of the sheep. They would fight off wolves. They would fight off wolves. I think the lesson that Jesus is trying to teach in John 10.10 10 10 is the lesson it's not that much Jesus is trying to teach in John 10.10 10 is you it's know, not much fun to be a shepherd. Fight off wild Who animals to, with you know, a stick. I mean, David, fight off wild King David animals talked about with bears and I mean, lions. David, and all King David sorts talked of about bears and lions what a job, and hey? all sorts of animals. No. What a not, job. Not a hey? job that many of us probably <laughs> no, would want to sign not, up for. Not a Jesus job that many saying, of us probably would want to sign what I up do. for. But Jesus is saying, I protect that's God's what people. I do. I I've actually come God's people. to look after them. I've actually come, I've come to guard to look them after from them. those that would steal I've kill come and to guard them ultimately, from those of course, that would steal, kill and destroy. Satan, but ultimately, but he's, of course, he's, he's wanting to protect Satan, but God's people. But he's he's from wanting false to protect teaching. God's people. And that's kind of the the from from immediate teaching. context, the moment. And that's that, kind of the the immediate to, context, the moment that you know. This is the picture of Jesus who kneels down with the woman caught in adultery. This is the picture of Jesus who kneels down with the woman caught in adultery. Who the dirt says, with you, and I will I'll be down you there from in your the, the dirt with you, and it's I will defend very you different from your posture to the Pharisees. It's a very different posture. The Pharisees who to the were Pharisees. the accusers. The Pharisees who came and who said, "God's law accusers. is a stick to beat you with." Who came and said, "God's law tell you is all a stick the things that you're with. doing wrong. All the ways we will tell that you're you all the things all the that you're doing wrong. All the ways we're not going to help you. All the problems. We're not going to join you in that. We're not going to help you. Jesus says, "We're not going to join you in that." I'm the shepherd. I will lead you to life. So yes, I will teach you. I'm the shepherd. I will lead you to life. So yes, I will show you the way. I will show you what is good. I will show you the way. I will show you what is good. But the I am your defender. Is so different. I am on I am your, your side. Defender. I am for you. I am. I on will your lay side, down my I am life for you. For you. I will lay down my life for you. It's only because of him that it's we have only life. because of him, and that we have life. You know, we we need to acknowledge and that. On the whole spectrum, you know, we, right? we need to acknowledge the that in our lungs on the whole spectrum comes right? from God. The breath in our lungs comes you know, from God. We have life because He chose to create. You know, we it. have life, life because is a gift. He chose to create it. Life Millions of gift. taste buds in our mouth. Millions of taste. We have buds more taste in buds our than I think we have any more other taste buds than the planet. I think our any noses other don't work as well on the planet. But our noses don't our work as well. Our taste buds are a gift from God. But that we don't just eat our taste for buds are a gift we from eat God. That we don't just enjoy eat it for nourishment. We, we enjoy eat God's creativity. And enjoy it. That's a gift. We enjoy Why God's we have creativity. We have a creator that delights. That's a gift in doing. Why we have a little creator things that delights the world um, in doing little for things, us to making enjoy. the world um, for us to but enjoy. Even more than that, He is the one that leads us but into eternal even life. Even more than that, He, he is, is the one who has laid down His life. He is the one and who has laid the down his one. life. He is the gate. And he is the only one. There is he no is other religion. The gate. There is no other there teaching. There is no other religion. There is no other way. There is no other teaching. Uh, for us to be redeemed from our There is no other way. Sins. Uh, for us to be redeemed, to be redeemed from, our from, our from our rebellion against God. To be redeemed from our rebellion through. against God. It is only through. So he says, yes, I am the gate. So he Those says, who yes, come in I me am the gate. Will be saved. Those who come in through me will be saved. So that's the the main point. So that's the Jesus is the main unlike point. any other. Jesus and he is, is the only unlike one unlike any other need. and he is the only Amen. one that we need. Now the people who Amen. Jesus was speaking to now, speaking to apparently the they who Jesus didn't was speaking to they didn't understand speaking what to, Jesus apparently was they saying. didn't get it. And, and this is part of what Jesus fun was saying of these, these and this chapters, is part of right? the fun. You've got of the man these, these who chapters, was blind right? You've got the man who was blind, not just physically, but spiritually. Not just physically, but spiritually. 
by all the this guy religious who was standards the right of the day, by his all life, the religious standards you know, of the day, in life, cursed. You know, this man in sin, comes to cursed. teach the religious this man leaders in the end. To teach the you guys are missing the, in the point. End. This is definitely you guys a man sent are missing by God. The point. Like this it's is as clear as day. a man sent he by sees. God. Like it's as clear as day. He sees. But others don't see. But the ones who claimed see. they could teach and lead to life, they the ones who claimed didn't they could teach clearly. and lead to life, they didn't and so see we clearly. we see that verse at the end of chapter nine. And so we, I entered we this see that world verse at the end of chapter nine. Judgment. I entered this to give world sight to, to the blind, blind judgment and to show to those give sight to the blind they see and to show those they are blind. who think they see. Jesus they has come to expose. Jesus some of our has arrogance, come to expose some of the ways we don't see, arrogance, some of the ways that we think we know, but actually we've got things wrong. Actually we've some of the ways that wrong. we think we know, but actually we've got things wrong. And on this point, I, I just want to touch on, you know, and on this the point, I, I just want to touch on, passage. we can be, you know, we can Pharisees easily be very critical. Often, we can be, right? we can easily be it's very critical. It's an obvious critical miracle often, right? to us. Jesus healed this it's guy. It's an obvious like, miracle to us. Let's get real. Jesus healed this guy. It's so like, easy like, for us to judge them and go, you guys. It's so easy for us to judge them and go, you guys. You guys arrogant. What are you doing? Arrogant. What are you doing? But the interesting thing is. As soon as we start but the doing interesting that, thing is we actually risk as becoming soon as we the start Pharisees, doing that, we? we actually risk go, becoming we see the better Pharisees, than you. don't we? We know better go, than you. We see better than you. Instead of walking we know in their shoes, you. trying to understand Instead them, of how they got to that shoes, point, trying to understand them, them, how they got to that point, we just judge them. And so I wonder, in all of so this, I wonder, why has Jesus given us John 10? In all why of this, God why has Jesus given us John 10? Why has God preserved this Passage this parable. Could it be that he actually wants us to be wary? Could it be that he actually wants becoming us to be like wary? Pharisees? Of becoming? Reminding like us Pharisees? that we too don't always see correct. Reminding, Reminding us that we too that don't we always need to see go to correct. Him Reminding us that, having our view that we need to checked. go to him and keep having our view checked. Sometimes perhaps we're not that different from them. Sometimes, sometimes we perhaps we're not that end up promoting from them. a sometimes Jesus we and end up promoting gospel. a Jesus. Right? So Jesus says, and "I gospel. am the gate." Right? So Jesus says, "I, I am your salvation." The gate. That's it. But sometimes I am your salvation. That's as Christians it. we can go. It's but sometimes Jesus, yes. As Christians we can and go. It's Jesus. Yes. Also, and uh, you need to do this. Also, or you need to get this uh, bit you sorted out. You need to, and we, or you we need to get this bit sorted down out. You need to, and we, we start watering you know, down. If you the don't believe this, you're not a Christian. You know, if you don't I've believe this, you're not a talk Christian. Talk about that on the topic of creation. I've heard people. You know, if you don't talk about that on the topic of creation, the view of you know, creation that I believe, then you know, the view of creation that I believe, then trusting God's word, or you're not really. Trusting and God's we, word. Or, throughout or generations, whatever. the hot topics we, change. Throughout For some generations, it's Jesus the hot topics the change. change. For some, it's Jesus, Jesus and, and the gift of standing tongues. against abortion. Jesus, Jesus and you've got to serve standing on against these abortion. Jesus and whatever. you've got to we, serve we on these rosters. Add to it. Whatever we, I know we a young man who came to, to faith a couple of years ago. I know a really young man who came to faith a couple church, of years actually. ago, and he's really struggled. Uh, he dresses a bit different, actually. You know, from uh, a very different a subculture different. to, what you know, from most a very of us different have probably subculture grown up with to have grown up in a Christian family. Most of us have probably grown up with people who've grown up in a Christian family. And there's an element for him and he where he feels out of place. Um, and there's an element Jesus for him and, where, you know, Jesus um, and you've got to look like Jesus us. Jesus and. Jesus you know, and Jesus you've, you've got to look like us. Talk like us. Jesus and you've got to all your stuff sorted out. You've got to have all your stuff sorted out. That Jesus starts with and extends to Zacchaeus. Starts the woman caught in adultery. It somehow gets Zacchaeus, lost. The woman caught in, in adultery. It somehow gets lost in translation. Now, obviously, now obviously, things that Jesus wants to teach us, right? And that's part of this parable as well. There's things that Jesus wants to teach us, right? He wants to transform our lives. Well, he wants to transform. Sometimes we can be guilty at looking at the but things sometimes that we, we can be we have got guilty right. at looking at the and things that we think we have got right who don't see it the and same way as us or, or haven't yet who don't see learned it the same way as us or, or haven't yet learned some of the things that Jesus it's important has to remember us. always that it's important to remember always that is tidying up our lives where salvation comes from is not where salvation it's part of the journey and it's a gift but it's part of the journey and it's a gift 
but it's not the starting point. Perhaps the reason God has preserved this passage for us is because perhaps the reason God has preserved this passage for us is because there are telling us they have the answers, and we need to be wise to that. And we need to be wise. When, when to that. Jesus said this, it was the Pharisees claiming they when, had the answers. When Jesus answers. said this, it was Why the she Pharisees wonder today claiming if we they need had to be answers. more wary at times. Why of, she wonder uh, today if we need to be church. more wary at times of uh, people YouTube. outside the church? TikTok, Snapchat, YouTube, social media, TikTok, news, Snapchat, advertising, social media, news. So many of them advertise claim that they've got what we need. So many for of life. them claim that they've if got what we this need product, for life. If you live like this, you have then this product. You will have life. If you live like this in abundance. Then you will have life. People in we abundance. don't even know. You know, people we don't even have know to speak to us. You know. Has anyone, anyone heard the expression to us? Skibbity? Has anyone heard the expression? Anyone with teenagers? <laughs> Gen anyone? Alpha, yeah. it's, anyone it's with become teenagers? a famous word for Gen their Alpha, generation, a, and they're probably abandoning it now because we're stereotyping and they're probably abandoning it now because we're stereotyping it. So they'll move on from it. I don't know where it came from. I suspect it's not Australian. I don't know where it came from. I suspect it's not Australian. But we live in a world where someone can come up with this weird phrase. But we live in a world where someone can come up with this weird phrase over in the states. Like how easily are we in? Spreads like wildfire. Like how easily are we influenced? And you know, I can stand here and talk beings. about that one. And you know, I can what stand here and talk about that, that one. Each of us. But what are the things that have influenced each of like us? Like the Pharisees were influenced and influenced like each other. And, oh yes, were yes, this is good teaching. And influenced each this other. This is wise. Yes, this is how this to is follow the Lord. This is wise. This is how we to know follow the answers. The Lord. What are the voices? We know that the have answers. Influenced us. What are the voices that have influenced us? I don't even know. I can't. I don't even know. Yep, I don't I even know. Talk to Bryce. He's more. Yep, I don't more even know. On it. Talk to Bryce. Um, he's more. Yeah, more knowledgeable on it. Um, um, right. So. Yeah. I, I just want um, to highlight anyone. Right. So it's not just. I, I just want to highlight anyone. On youth culture. It's not just right. And please don't hear me ragging on youth culture. To right. being any one of us by is wide range of voices. To being influenced and some of them are people who are setting voices. themselves up to be and some of them are people who are setting themselves up to be news apps. Experts. Experts. Things come through. Um, people who claim to be relationship experts. Things come through. People who claim to be relationship experts. People who claim to be therapists and all sorts of things. And some people who claim to be therapists and all sorts of things. Things you read. Are, are actually not, um, you know, some um, of the things you read well are, are actually not um, particularly well. And sometimes, informed. particularly on social media, and sometimes there is particularly on social media, there is people who are not accountable to anyone. Tested. Yeah, they're, they're, they're not going through aren't a university yeah, program or an academic program, going through where they're a university program or an academic want. program and, where they're peer reviewed. And sometimes reviewed. we lack they it say up. whatever they want, and and sometimes there we are people. Lack it up. Putting themselves up as Bible teachers. There are people and there's a putting themselves up as Bible on the teachers internet and of there's trying a to explain huge culture how we don't need on to the trust internet the Bible. Of trying to explain that, um, how we don't need to you know, trust the Bible. You know, it was all just written by humans. That, um, and, um, you know, it was yeah, all just written by not humans. A, a and um, heresy yeah, really. This is probably not been around for a while, but heresy really. You know, people giving long winded. But lectures you know, people on giving YouTube, long explaining how they've done all this research on YouTube, stuff. explaining how they've there done are many all these voices research trying to stuff. lead us astray. There are many voices trying to lead us astray. So the big question I want us to sit with today. So the big question is, I want us to sit with today. Whose voice are you listening to? Is and I want to phrase it whose voice you listening to? How often and I want are you phrase it slightly Jesus. different? How often are you coming to, to Jesus? How are you listening putting to that voice? in place in your life? How what are, are your you rhythms? putting that in place in your life? What are your rhythms? How often are you asking for his advice and then How listening, often are you waiting, asking for his advice for and then listening to give you waiting, answers to lead you? For him to give you answers to lead are you. Are you following him? Are you following him? In this parable there's that warning that that some people in this parable uh, there's that warning that, won't listen that some people for his voice. some people uh, are content not won't to won't listen for his voice. Some people are content don't encourage not to. you to pray not to be one of those people. I encourage you to pray not to pray, be Lord, help one me of those people. To value what pray, you have Lord, to help say me and to listen to, to it. To value what you have to say and to listen to it. Jesus says you know, my sheep listen to my voice. Jesus says, he says they will come you know, my in sheep listen and to go my voice. out. He says they, they will find come good in pasture. and go out. They will find it's good It's not about pasture. control with Jesus. It's not about control right? there is with Jesus. A breath of freedom in the way right? there is he presents a breath of freedom in the way 
he presents there is rhythm. his teaching. I'm just touching on some of the rhythm. things that are that are in there now. I'm just touching on some of the things that are that are in there now. We we don't have time come to explore. Come in and go this, out. Rhythm, you will right? rest. Come in you'll find and go pasture, out. You but then you'll rest. rub shoulders with the sheep. You'll find who aren't pasture, yet part but of my then you'll rub shoulders with There's the sheep. There's work to be done. Yet part of my flock. It's time to be in the communal sheep pen. It's time to be in the communal sheep pen. People who heard this originally probably would have thought of People Psalm who 23. Heard this originally as probably would have thought of Psalm 23. As soon as Jesus starts talking the Lord about is sheep my and shepherd, shepherd, I shall not want. He leads the me Lord by is my green shepherd, pastures. I shall not want. He leads me by green pastures. I think there's elements of Matthew 11 in here. Where Jesus I think says, there's elements of Matthew 11 who are in weary here. And need where Jesus rest. says, come to me all I will you give who you are weary and need rest. But I will come and work rest. with me. But there's elements of Luke nine and ten, the teaching around people. There's elements of, peace. of Luke nine and ten. There are the some who will around hear Jesus' voice and follow him. There are some, there are who, are some who will hear to. Jesus' voice and follow him. There are and some we who need are to be wise to that. Who are we? And we need to be who wise praying to that? about who are we trying who to share we, the gospel with. Who are we praying there's about? Who are we trying to share the gospel parable. with? I'm going to leave it there, but I want to make sure I leave. I'm going to leave it there, but I want to who's make sure I leave you with the question: Whose voice are you listening to? Let me pray for us. Let me pray for us. Loving God, I want to thank you for loving God. Just I want to thank amazing you moment for just this amazing moment in Scripture. This just amazing in witness and testimony this we have. Just of amazing you. witness and testimony you we have of you, our teacher. You, you are our are Lord, our teacher. You are our. Lord. You deserve all of our worship. You deserve all of our worship. Every answer you have, every word every that you speak, every answer you have, every word that you speak, it is so good, so right. It is so good. We so should right. bow down to everything that you have to say. We should bow down to everything that you have to say. No one is more knowledgeable than you. No, no one, one has is better more knowledgeable than you. than you. No one has better answers than you. You are God. All knowing, all powerful. You are God. All knowing, all powerful. And yet, and yet, you come with an invitation. You come with an invitation. You come and say that you are here to gently lead. You come and, and say that you are here to gently lead and invite. You are not like the Pharisees. You who are not like down the on Pharisees who, who want to look scold down on us. Who, who want, want to, to label us, us? Who want to label us? You are the one who wants to love us. You are the one who wants to love us. And God, I give thanks for that contrast. That you are not. And God, I give thanks for that contrast. Well, you are not like you us. Are not, well, you are not like us. You are so much more worthy of our trust. You are so and much more praise. worthy of our trust. And our Holy praise. Spirit, will you help us to? Holy Spirit, will you help us how to good you are? Remember fall how good in love you are. and adore you afresh. And to fall each in day. love and adore you afresh each day. Help us to know that your voice is so so good. Help us to know that your voice is so so good. And God, stir in our heart, make us hungry to hear from and you. And God, stir in our heart, make us hungry to hear from you. Let us come to you in conversation. And ask Let us you come to you in conversation in our life. and ask you questions about all things in our life. Let us come to your word and allow you to remind us of who you are. Let us come to your word and allow you to remind us of who you are, of what your kingdom looks like. Lord, that we may then get to know your voice and your character Lord, that we so may well. then get to know your voice and your character That we can so recognize well. the thieves and the robbers in that our life. That we can recognize the thieves we can recognize and the robbers in our life. Those voices that aren't yours. We can recognize... Those voices that aren't yours. Lord, help us to become familiar with you. Lord, help us to become familiar with you. That we easily and eagerly follow that we after what is good. Easily and eagerly follow after every what is day. good. Every day. God bless us with that, and I pray that uh, for God each bless of us, us with here, that, and I pray help that us to walk out of here uh, for with each the of us here, you will help us to walk uh, to out walk of here with, with the you. commitment to find time uh, to walk with you, to, to listen, find time to know you, to listen, to cherish to and value that relationship, to cherish and value that relationship. Where you know us by name, but we, where you we know us know by name, so but well we, well. 
we also know your lead voice us so well as well. Out of here this morning with a renewed lead us passion out of and here desire this morning to with a renewed you, I pray. passion and desire to Amen. follow you, I pray. Amen.